His visit symbolically reaffirms bilateral relationships between PNG and Australia through the single strongest historical bond between the nations. Following tradition, Turnbull laid a wreath in honor of sacrifices made by Australian troops and the Papua New Guineans who assisted them during the Kokoda campaign of 1942. He was then led on a walk that took him down a sacred memory lane. Each tombstone encapsulated stories of sacrifice, battles lost and victories alike. Uh, we've got people mixed completely up uh, as they are. It's the... the Bamana Cemetery is only one of numerous memorials across the country that preserve the memory of more than 8,000 Australians who lost their lives in a selfless fight for justice. 300 of which were killed in a five-day battle against the Japanese on the fateful August of 1942 in Isurava, Northern Province. Turnbull also visited the site's memorial prior to Bomana in the company of Oro Governor Gary Jufa. The Isurava Memorial features four Australian black granite pillars that are each engraved with a single word, courage, endurance, mateship and sacrifice values and qualities of Australian soldiers who fought along the Kokoda track. The Australian Prime Minister reflected on the significance of battles like that fought in Isurava as evidence of the solidarity between the people of Papua New Guinea and Australia. We see 75 years ago, people of Papua New Guinea, Australians, fought side by side to keep Australia free, to defend Australia from invasion, to defend Papua New Guinea from the invasion of the Japanese Imperial Army. Those bonds that were b built then are enduring. Their conquest played a critical role in driving out Japanese soldiers in the aftermath of the Pacific War. Melissa Gofiro, National MTV News.